Oh yeah, yeah. Long time no heard me, right? Well, I think for this topic I need to use my voice because there are many things in it that has to be explained. As you could see earlier, the content is going to get wider, in the close future I will test cars in games where performance tuning is not available too. That's called Lap Timing City Dash, and the first videos will come about an undercover cup game with open world and very strong focus on driving. This is Driver 3. As I wanted to check if the cars in the game have any name, uh, because unlike of GTA or Saints Row games here it's not displayed, and found them on the game's fandom page, had to realize the naming system is a complete mess. Can't see any better, one car has two or three words, others have only one, brand system isn't developed at all, and ok Rockstar also introduced it only with GTA 4, but until then they were already consistent in naming. So I thought about how could driver 3 cars be named in the modern GTA system. All three cities, Miami, Nice and Istanbul, have unique and authentic vehicle roster with some overlaps in trucks and buses. Most vehicles are passenger cars and each area has two different bikes, a speedy one and a not so much, a taxi, a police car, a bus, a van, a big truck and a smaller truck, plus some extras like a forklift, a go-kart or an open wheel racing car. If we count everything, including the secret cars, there are 66 rides in the game, but because of the aforementioned overlaps, only 61 different models. Alright, now I really have to talk about the rides and their names. Let's start with Tenor's home ground of Miami, or as I'm going to call it, Vice City. Of course the streets are filled with American cars, with some Italian and British spies. It means I had pretty easy work here, because many rides are found in GTA episodes 2, like the Virgo, the Rancher or the Bullet. Of course there were some cases where I had to be creative, a good example is the Grand Espedizione 76, which is based upon a late 70s Ford Torino. Brand selection was easy because Ford cars are called Rapid, but what should be the secondary name? Went with the Italian line and called it Venezia, as locals called Venice. Moving to the next place over the Atlantic Ocean to the French Riviera, the beautiful Nice. Because Grand Theft Auto games are bound to the United States, with a sole exception, I had to come up with a city name by myself. Fortunately the city's name is a great ground for working, that's why it is très bien without space. It means pretty good or nice in French of course in two words. 
it also sounds very French and very important that it's unique. There aren't any other cities called by this in real life. Turning to the cars, well, I had plenty of work. Lucky that since I started to work on this video, the first Renault has arrived in Los Santos, so this work I mentioned got easier. There are many Penaults in Trebien, including the bus which is a Savien that Brad has been eaten by Renault. Meanwhile Citroën, including Talbot that brings us the local taxi, is called Ariane, I had to create it by myself. Got French secondary names for all of them as well, a single example, the Lecompact XS, that's based on a Renault 25, is going to be called Peno Citadel here, also referring to its flagship status in the brand's variety. Another thing, I know that Windsor is under the Enus brand now, but in San Andreas its model was a straight up Jaguar E-Type and Dagger Type T is also an E-Type with the front of the XK120, another Jag, so that's why it's under the Ocelot flag. last city, the place of the big finale, is the capital of Turkey, Istanbul. Because Turkish language is very far from me, I feel myself lucky with my choice. I remember the word the Gensler Beer League from somewhere, I think from club football so long ago. Now I looked after the meaning of its second part and turned out that Beer League means unity, which is a perfect description of Istanbul. Traffic is very mixed, old American cruisers and some modern French ones with lots of commercial vehicles. Also the only two Japanese cars are in this roster, two generations of Lisa Fairlady, the very early one and the first big hit, the 240Z. The whole traffic shows the large financial and economic difference, we can hardly talk about any average passenger cars here. This is the place where I had to name almost everything by myself, even the American cars, but my bright pick goes to the older fair lady which is called originally as Jäger Roaster LS28 by the way. Fair lady got its name after the show My Fair Lady which was the favorite show of the original fair lady's designer. I chose another very popular show The Cats and translated this word to Japanese. That's why you can see it here as Nekotachi.
this is all I wanted to tell and show. Keep the pace with the tango. Ayaya. Ah, yeah, yeah.